Hey guys, welcome back. I hope y'all are doing well. So yeah, I'm continuing in 2013 with uh, Capital City's release in a tidal wave of mystery. Overall, I felt it was a decent album as compared to what I looked at last week. I felt it was interesting throughout uh, even with the feature from Andre 3000, this is uh, Duo's debut studio album that was released on June 4th, 2013. The album has a runtime of about 44 minutes and contains four singles being Safe and Sound, Kangaroo Court, I Sold My Bed But Not My Stereo, and One More Minute. The duo of Ryan Merchant and Sebu Simonian works as jingle writers for various companies before uh, they eventually met online uh, from Craigslist and decided to form Capsule Cities. The pair would write Safe and Sound and was would also uh, begin working on their debut album, in which the title came from a lyric in Safe and Sound, being from the third verse. <clears throat> I always found the uh, cover art interesting. Uh, it was designed by Brazilian artist Ch uh, Chao Laura Fonte. Uh, I know I probably mispronounced that name, but I do apologize if I did. The album was released under Capsule Records and was the first Capsule Records album to be distributed by Universal Music Group following the breakup of Capsule's previous distributor, EMI. Features on the album include Andre 3000 and Sosa. Let's go ahead and hop into some of the tracks. We start this album off with Safe and Sound. I still enjoy the track all this time later. And uh, it always has me coming back as I feel it's a nice blend of synth pop. I also feel the vocals are enjoyable here. Lyrically, I feel the track is about knowing whatever happens in life. You and your loved ones will be together through all of this. Patience gets us nowhere fast isn't too bad of a track itself. It does sound a little bit radio friendly, but again, both guys uh, worked on jingles before eventually forming and, uh, you know, recording this uh, album. It makes the uh, track uh, appeal to more of an audience though, in a way to say nonetheless. Uh, it was interesting hearing both guys sing together, but I felt their uh, vocals were decent overall. I didn't mind the inch mill either. Lyrically, I feel the track is about a person explaining how they see their love at the same time. Uh, well, uh, like saying to uh, make up their mind and uh, that even patience uh, can be something good. Kangaroo Court continues uh, more of the synth pop sound. I did feel it was an interesting track. We do get a trumpet solo here, which I enjoyed. Uh, throughout the album, we get a little bit of trumpet and some brass instruments, uh, which I've always enjoyed, and especially on uh, Safe and Sound. Farrah Fawcett Hair was an interesting track, and we do get some more 80 exp inspired lyrics, or at least what was popular from uh, that time. We also get a feature from Andre 3000. Uh, I felt it was a decent feature, but you know, with this being my first time hearing this track for 
uh, you know, this review, uh, I, you know, really thought was interesting. And, uh, time or two, I kind of thought, uh, the feature may have been a little out of place and whatnot, but, you know, uh, giving it a couple of listens, I, uh, you know, feel it was a decent feature. And we also did get some feature, uh, featured vocals from Frank, uh, Taveras. I didn't mind short truce. I did enjoy the chorus here. Lyrically, I feel the track is about no matter what happens and no matter what way or how you're colored, uh, you're great how you are. We're keeping the theme of art with origami, I felt was another decent track with its instrumental. Lyrically, I feel the track is about figuring someone out and getting to know them. I'll finish us off with Love Away. I felt it was an enjoyable track to finish off the album. Of course, the theme of the track is essentially just go out and love one another every day, no matter what. Even if uh, you feel there's no one that believes it, uh, like, you know, possibly some of your friends, uh, you have to go out and love others. My favorite tracks are Safe and Sound, Patience Gets Us Nowhere Fast, Kangaroo Court, I Sold My Bud But Not My Stereo, Chartreuse, Origami, and Love Away. Today, I'll be giving this album a four and a half out of five. Alright guys, there's that. Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, the last review of October 2023 is, you know, already here. And, you know, uh, you know, you made sound if you've made it this far into the video. Uh, but yeah, as usual, feel free to leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Uh, and I hope y'all enjoy this last Friday of October and have a nice last weekend of the month. I also hope y'all have a fun and safe Halloween if you're celebrating this weekend or are going to do something special uh, for the day on Tuesday since uh, that's when Halloween falls this year, this upcoming Tuesday. Anyways, next week, kicking off November, yes, already November, I'll be looking at 1993 by Naughty by Nature. So yeah, there's that, and again, have a fun and safe weekend, and again, hope y'all have a fun and enjoyable Halloween if you're going to be doing something for the day.